Hey everyone, my name is Timotheus Ferrell Gordon. I am the co-owner of Ability Soda and also the writer of a personal blog called Ferrell's Principles, which is in the op-ed section of Ability Soda. And I wanted to say happy birthday to the Joystick Journey, which is turning one today. I mean, nay, I've seen you grown and I've seen your blog grow at the same time. And both of y'all have been remarkable throughout. Y'all just grow stronger and stronger and y'all reach out to more people as the weeks and months goes by. And, you know, just keep up the good work in spreading the awareness, matter of fact, spreading the acceptance of disabilities, especially for people in wheelchairs. Cause let's face it, I got to admit, before reading the Joystick Journey, I already paid attention to such things. Also caught up in trying to live in a The you know, I try to live in a normal world as an autistic person, and I worry about that so much that I never even thought of other disabilities, I never thought of the day to day life of someone in a wheelchair, or even day to day life of anyone with disabilities outside of autism but you taught me a great lesson do not overlook the person give people a chance and by editing your material and by reading your blogs like every week I begin to open my mouth I begin to open my eyes more and more to like a lot of stuff I never thought of. Like the pain, the pain people have just trying to escape, or trying to just go out, but they can't because they're stuck in a wheelchair or the struggle to express themselves without, without having a representative speaking for them like parents or doctors. And I realize everybody on the same page. Because I, I believe that all people with disabilities have some type of struggle. And even the people that I know, we definitely struggle with trying to have our own voice in things. Our own voice in writing, music, art, anything. Even in our day-to-day -day lives, we struggle to find our own voices. And ultimately, that's what the joystick journey is about, is trying to find our own voice in situations where we feel caged. And also, the joystick journey taught me more about the disability community. And I think as a result, I became more of a stronger advocate. For, for that community. And it also made me a stronger advocate for the, for the autistic community as well. But in short, I think ability, no, excuse me, I think the joystick journey could just open people's eyes to things in the disability community that people never um, thought of before. And I hope that it continues to open people's eyes and one day create a huge movement. And I'm ready to join in. But it was, that's all. Good luck with another year of success with writing 
the blog, nay. Love you. And happy writing. <laughs>